Content creation ought to be enjoyable, efficient and easy. So we've designed our edit tools to be just that. Here you can see the stories listing, where you can find a list of all of the stories you've created. Content created in Turtle is structured in two levels. These levels are called Surf and Immerse. Surf levels are highly visual with big images and short headlines. They act as chapter pages to divide your content into sections and make it easy for your readers to find what they are interested in. When your reader finds a chapter that they are interested in reading, they can click down into the Immerse level to read more. Your Immerse levels contain the content for each chapter, including body copy, images, videos and other interactive elements. To create a new story, click on Create New. Start by deciding on how to structure your content and put your surf pages in place. Creating a surf page is as easy as typing in your heading and subheading, choosing a style and selecting an image. You can choose to upload images direct from your computer, copy and paste a URL or search an image bank of over 9 million rights-free images. Each style option has different colour variations available and everything is pre-configured to be perfectly on-brand, meaning you can focus on your content while Turtle takes care of fonts, colours and other design elements. You can experiment with different settings until your content is looking just right. including recropping your image to best fit with your copy. Remember to check the mobile preview to see how your content will look on mobile devices. You can recrop the image whilst in the mobile preview and it won't change how it appears on desktop. We recommend that you create all of your surf pages first so that the flow of your content is in place as early as possible. Keep your first surf page as a cover page with no Immerse section to help your readers navigate. Creating an Immerse page is just as easy. Start by choosing the Immerse tab and click Edit Content to start adding your words, images, videos and more. An intuitive text editor lets you quickly place and style your text, making use of all of the formatting options you're familiar with. The branding is preset so that all of the styling is automatically on brand. Adding images, videos, polls, quotes, maps, and other interactive features is easy. Just select the widget you want to use from the toolbar and start editing. This is a good start, but what if we want something more exciting? By pinning and resizing the widgets, we can start to break our columns up and make things more appealing for our reader. You can pin the widgets to fix them to a certain position on the page, span the widgets across multiple columns, and drag and drop the widgets to another location within your Immerse level. You can even spread text across multiple columns by adding it to a feature box. To turn pinning on, toggle the pinning icon in the top right corner of the widget. When the pin has been activated, the widget border will turn purple. To move the widget, hover over it so you can see the move icon and then drag the widget to where you would like it on the page. You can drag it to span it across multiple columns and resize it. You can change the page a widget is pinned on by accessing the settings menu. If you want to change the focus of an image within the border, 
Press and hold the Alt key and then reposition your image. Release Alt for your new image crop to be saved. Each widget also has a settings page where you can configure a variety of options. To access the settings page, hover over the widget and click on the cog. You can add captions to your widgets, and you can also add titles so that you can easily identify the widget in the analytics dashboards later. You can also hyperlink images or turn on the zoom function. This is particularly useful if you're using a small graph or infogram. Remember to check the mobile preview to see how your immerse level appears on mobile devices. Your content will be displayed in portrait mode and follow the flow of content in the immerse editor. Any widgets will be visible exactly in the position they appear within your content, even if it's pinned to a different position on the desktop preview. You can reposition widgets whilst in mobile preview to reorder your content, but remember that this won't change the position of pinned widgets in the desktop view. When you're happy, just click continue to carry on working. From the main preview window, you can turn on lead capture forms to gate your content, change the number of columns in your layout, and you can move and resize pinned widgets. A handy timeline at the bottom of the screen lets you copy, paste, add, remove and reorder your pages as you wish. The timeline also lets you access the back cover to make a range of customizations. Your content is automatically saved every 30 seconds, but you can also save manually by clicking the Save button. When you're finished, just click Finished. So that's how content is made in Turtle. If you'd like more information and guidance, our knowledge base is the very best place to start.